Hi everyone, my name is Jacqueline and in this video, I'll be walking through the homelessness data dashboards located on the Hawaii Behavioral Health Dashboard. The homelessness data dashboards are located on the third tab of the dashboard section and it presents homelessness data from the U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development, Partners in Care, and Bridging the Gap. The homelessness dashboards for each data source are all formatted in a similar way, with each focusing on different geographic areas. The first tab of the homelessness data dashboards is the U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development, or HUD. HUD is a federal agency that addresses housing needs, improves and developed communities, and enforces fair housing laws through national policy and programs. One of HUD's programs is the Continuum of Care program, and HUD requires continuums of care to conduct a point-in-time count or PIT count. The PIT count is a count of people experiencing sheltered and unsheltered homelessness carried out on one night in the last 10 calendar days of January or at such other time as required by HUD. The HUD tab provides information relating to homelessness in the state of Hawaii. The state of Hawaii has two continuums of care, Partners in Care and Bridging the Gap. Partners in Care makes up the second dashboard tab. Partners in Care is the continuum of care for Oahu and is the lead organization for the Oahu point in time count. The third tab is Bridging the Gap, which is the continuum of care for the counties of Kauai, Maui, and Hawaii. The left side of each dashboard contains dropdowns and lists that allows users to filter the homelessness data by categories such as year, location, and living situation. Below the filters are buttons to navigate to pages with demographic and subpopulation breakdowns. There is also a button for definitions, which will open a pop-up containing terms relating to homelessness, including the types of shelters. Each dashboard contains two graphs and four cards that can be adjusted by the filters. The main summary page contains homelessness data by year, location, and the type of living situation. For example, the current filters show homelessness for the year 2020 in the state of Hawaii, broken down by whether individuals were living unsheltered in transitional housing or in an emergency shelter, as well as overall sheltered counts and total homelessness counts. The first graph is a bar graph and users can use this graph to look at homelessness counts for multiple locations. To select multiple locations, users can use Ctrl plus click in the filter. Users can also hover their cursor over the graph to show a pop-up with more information about the data. The second graph is a line graph showing year-over-year -year homelessness data by living situation for the selected location. The cards on the right-hand side highlight sheltered and unsheltered homelessness data for the state of Hawaii and the nation for the selected year. On the demographic page, the homelessness data can also be filtered by demographic categories such as gender and race. The graphs on this page are a pie graph and a line graph comparing demographic groups for the selected location and living situation. The cards on the right side of the dashboard highlight the gender and race with the highest counts of homelessness in the state of Hawaii and nation for the selected year and living situation. The subpopulation page contains homelessness data by specific populations including people experiencing chronic homelessness, chronic substance abuse, or mental illness. Similar to the summary page, the subpopulation page has a bar graph and a line graph. The graphs can be used to look at homelessness data within a subpopulation group broken down by living situation. The cards on the right-hand side highlight sheltered and unsheltered homelessness data for the state of Hawaii and the nation for the selected year and subpopulation. Users can go back to the first page by clicking the Return to Summary page button. The Homelessness Data Dashboards serve as an informational resource for homelessness data in the state of Hawaii. To learn more about the Homelessness Data Dashboards, please visit the Hawaii Behavioral Health Dashboard. Thank you for watching.